This is a household once indicator that would have probably been in a kitchen mm. somewhere. Uh, and it works by flicking one of these tags against the item that you wanted to order. What strikes me is you could make uh, spend a nice little bit of time thinking how many of these things we still would put on a list. Um, yes. Half stones we would yes. <laughs> abandon yes. at once. I think glass has a use, but it's very limited. When we, we had this out for the children that came in one day, and they didn't they didn't know what icing glass was. Neither did the other two ladies who were here because they were a lot younger, um, and the children didn't know what dentifrice was right. because no, they'd only no. ever come across toothpaste, yes. not dentifrice. Yes, mm. yes, yes. What struck me was not only was there hearthstone, which is a name I'm familiar with for scrubbing one's outdoor steps to look nice, but we've got a white stone here mm. as well, a whiting stone, which I presume is similar, but I've not heard of that. Mm. Icing glass, of course, is, it makes me think of the war when we had big containers um, and when there were some spare eggs, which was very rare, they were put into icing glass but you couldn't use them afterwards for boiling eggs. They had to be for cake or puddings cooking, or something. Yes. Yeah. When I was a child in some, growing up in Somerset, the primary schools had a competition between them. For In the autumn, you'd take in eggs, and they were preserved in Isinglass for the local hospital. Oh. Uh, and there was sort of, you know, a competition as to which primary school could provide the most the most eggs for for the local hospital. Mm. Presumably, a lot of children came in Somerset came from the rural areas. And the, the area we farms. came from, yes. I mean, we oh, had yes. well, we had hen, a lot of people had hens at the bottom of the garden. Exactly. That we did. Yes. 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 Quite interesting to see the name Charles Letts and Company. We think of them as diary and calendar producers. Mm -hmm. But I certainly remember one in my step-grandmother's kitchen, um, very similar to this. No, I've never seen anything mm. like this before. Not even in my grandmother's house. Presumably <laughs> it must be from about the 1920s or 30s because it has electric bulbs. That's a good oh, observation, yeah. yes. Yeah. Yes. So, uh, although it's also got burning oil, Hollowware, I think, were, um, yes, sort of uh, things to contain berries and flour and so on. But, mm. but it, I think they were turned on a lathe and then had a hollow interior. I thought I'd heard Hollowware in relation to T.G. Green, who were at um, Woodville Swaddling Coat, mm. who made the the Cornish ware, but also the um, pots, um, bowl, bowl, mixing bowls. Yes, I think <coughs> on this one, though, they worked particularly hard to think of all the things they could think of, mm -hmm. because, uh, as we have noted, for several of the things you might think might sort of overlap a bit, but they don't, or they mm -hmm. don't mind. Mm -hmm. And they've got things like turpentine, which would be you wouldn't, don't, don't suppose you'd have wanted all the time, would you? Is it used for cleaning? I'm, I'm not know. all sure. I can remember it being a man. I was thinking of it in paint or anything. But, um, yes, there are uh -huh. two or three things that you probably wouldn't have indoors, but mm -hmm. they'd be down the yard. Mm. Uh, and I guess turpentine came into that. Uh, mm. category. Interesting the number of polishes starting with plate powder, mm. boot polish, shoe polish, sorry, floor, furniture, grate and metal. Interesting mm. that the grate polish is distinguished from the metal polish. Mm. 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 And I see there's uh, glass 
It's rather a bare request to put on a shopping list, isn't it? Mm. Mm. Yeah. yeah. So there are some hardware items as well as the um, food, bath yes. bricks, another yeah. one I guess was bought at a hardware shop. And they were doing their best to get through the alphabet. <laughs> but also a little space that if you uh, if there was something you'd forgotten oh, that yeah. would wanted it, something yeah. else you could add it yes hmm. sea oatmeal I'm not sure what sea oatmeal means chopped biscuits oxo and egg ravioli in brackets swiss <laughs> <laughs> 